Hey, what's up, my Kool Aid Dad peeps? It is me, your Kool Aid Dad Asian in the house. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It's Andre, the hot camera guy, with my you can't let a scruff yarn to me. Yes. <laughs> As we promised, we we wanted to do a movie review. Actually, two movie reviews, all in one. One is dealing with the Ghost of Mississippi. Not too sure if that's showing up correctly on your side, but it should be. Yes, Ghost, the Ghosts of Mississippi. This one deals with Whoopi Goldberg and Alec Baldwin and James Wood, and which is a great movie. And the other one is, which is in the movies right now, uh, The Help. This movie, Ghosts of Mississippi, is dealing with the woman Merle Evers, uh, wife of Medgar Evers. Uh, Medgar Evers was a civil rights leader um, back in the 60s, I believe, right? 60s? 50s, 60s. 50s, 60s. And... Uh, his uh, he got, Medgar Evers got killed in Jackson, Mississippi, and and both times when the the man who shot him, or who believe was believed to sh have shot him, had hung juries during that time, and it's crazy because thirty years had gone by, and Andre's looking the thing, thirty years had gone by. And finally, in the 90s, they re reopened the case and brought the man to justice. Byron Della Beckwith. Yes. So, and that's the guy that plays... James Wood. Plays um, the um, guy who shot him. Uh, and it's a really, really good movie that talks about civil rights. And for me, it kind of gives me a confidence booster now that we're fighting for... Um, equality and gay marriage and everything like that. So it gives us a, a little of a quality of a booster of how far we've come as a country. Now we're fighting for say, um, rights of our own, and get, it gives us that type of confidence, you know. And it's a really good movie, kind of underrated, I think. Really underrated, um, to say the least. But. Uh, if you really want to see something that's really hardcore, a, good movie. a really good quality movie, then I really would suggest this movie. I don't know if it's all straight. Really suggest this movie. It's about how long is this movie? I don't know how long this movie is. 130 minutes, so not that long. It's about a little less than two hours. And that camera's too close. <laughs> and the other movie is The Help. We saw, got to see the movie The Help, and I forgot the names of the actresses that's in that movie. There's a lot of them. A lot of them. But the movie is based on these maids that worked for white, um, white um, households that um, finally got to tell their story um, to a, a, a rising journalist who want, wanted to kind of um, write stories and um, be in journalism and she got to write um, a story from the point of view of the maids and it was very powerful because Megger Evers was mentioned in that movie and it was also in Jackson, Mississippi which Jackson, Mississippi and anywhere in Mississippi still has a little bit of I, I wouldn't say I, I, I don't want to sound racist but it still has let's stop it there but it happens in Jackson, Mississippi no, oh, I want to know That's <laughs> discrimination, uh, race there, there's still discrimination present G see that's why I have you honey there's still discrimination you're present you're talking about in the movie right? in the movie yeah and, and from what people has, has told me there, there's still discrimination down here in the south well, we don't know that. And we don't know that for a fact, but from what people says, there is still discrimination anywhere in the world. And But you ain't hear that from us, because we ain't want to gossip. <laughs> but um, anyways, that movie is a great movie, because it talks about how women, um, black women, had to uh, deal with the white households, and how they separated each other from uh, like bathrooms, and how they thought it was a disease. Uh, these women had um, diseases. They thought if they would let black women use, the, the maids use their restrooms in their houses, that they would get diseases and stuff from them using their, because uh, mm -hmm. they have, they thought that black people had different diseases than they did. 
What, what did you tell me that about white, um, about black women, how they had to deal with stuff in the workplace and then go home? Yeah, I mean, you get to see, I told, was, was telling Jason about, um, you know, you have to think about it. You have black women that used to come, uh, that work as maids. They come and clean white, the white people's house, you know, and take care of their children for all day long. And then once they put their kids to bed, feed them, fix dinner, you know, they have to go home, be it walk, catch the bus, walk again. You know, they, most of them have long journeys to travel, which is another good movie, The Long Walk Home, starring uh, Whoopi Goldberg as well. But, um, you know, you have to go home and then you have to tend to your own family. That was a good question that the lady asked in the movie. You know, how do you feel... You know, taking care of uh, white people's kids when someone else is at home taking care of your kids. And it makes you really start thinking about stuff like that. And then uh, you have to go home and a lot of them were getting beat by their husbands. You know, um, just the everyday struggle, you know. Yeah, and pe I think people will take for granted nowadays how, how far they've come. How far we've come as we've Americans. Come, yeah, as Americans. Um, and it's, it's just plain crazy at how... I look at the, these movies, Ghost of Mississippi and uh, The Help, that it really is difficult to watch how they, they went through back in the day. You know? Because there was some moments in these two movies that it was hard to really see. And hard, it would get you upset because of how people got treated back then. And, you know, it's, it makes you think. So I really suggest, I really suggest if you really want to watch good quality movie, uh, movies is Ghosts of Southern Mississippi and The Help. Uh, if you guys want to go out for a date or something, that would be... It has their funny moments. <coughs> yes, the movie was really funny. It, it was funny, but also serious at the same time. Because it talks about all these things that people have to go through, equality, and trying to... Um, it was a funny spin on a serious movie. Yeah. So, anyways, we'll be seeing you guys in a few. Well, I think we're not going to be doing a video until we get to Hawaii. Um, like we said, we're going to be there for four months. And, yeah. We have a lot of preparations to do. Preparations. To get ready to go. But, um, yeah, check out that movie. The Help. It's in theaters now. It came out today. It's a really, really good movie. Not for just black women, but for women, period. You know, you, you know, where I grew up, you know, is, has, uh, we weren't separated by race. We were separated by, uh, Class. S stature. You know, well, the, all the broke people were together. Black people, white people, and Vietnamese. We were all down there in South Baltimore, broke together. We all ate at each other's house, and we all we did everything together. But once you cross a certain threshold, a part of which is part of the city, you know, your class changes, and they try to run you back to where you, where your status, where your people were. So we all got treated like garbage together. So fortunately for me, I didn't have to grow up with uh, segregation. I didn't even know what segregation and racism was until I joined the military. Yep. So. Anyways, um, great movie. Great movies. We'll catch you guys all later, though. Keep an open mind when you watch it, though. Yes, please do. And just think about you know what we're fighting for nowadays. You know what type of equality um, we have to fight for nowadays. So just keep that in mind. We've come a long way as a we society. Have. And we, even though it's slow, it's a slow process. You know, it, it's encouraging. It, these two movies are encouraging to people nowadays so um hopefully we'll get to see you before we leave if not we'll see you guys in hawaii hawaii hey, oh, yeah. bye i want to lick your nipples no <laughs> <laughs>